studies. Features. The facilities. Um, it's very complete and yeah, it's very good for our learning process. Uh, no, no, it's just really fun and I like the, how it uses iPads as learning tools. I like the most probably because there is nice teachers, I have friends, and also there's a lot of technology and a lot of challenge in the school. Uh, I really like how they have the freedom for us to learn anything that we want to, to explore what we need to learn and to just do what we, we think that is best for us. What I like most about the school is the flexibility in their courses and its promotion of, well, independent study, like, you know, individualized studying. Usually in a normal public school, they tell you what to learn and not actually, like, teaching how to learn. Because in Noble Academy, you have to use your critical thinking, not actually remembering the subject that you need to understand. Visual art, science, maths, because it's really interesting. I just like, I like language arts and um, art. STEM, because we code in STEM with Python. My favorite subject is art because I like to be creative and I'm really good at drawing and coloring and yeah, that's why I enjoy it. Math Khan Academy, because the subject is using iPad and we can hear music. Be a test pilot or an engineer. Find money, make money to help others. I want to be a professional dancer. I want to be a dancer for as long as I could. And if I cannot dance anymore, I want to be a ballet teacher. Well, I would like to have enough projects in my portfolio to be proud of. Uh, in the future, I would like to be an uh, engineering in creating robots and coding because I'm really interested in that. and pastor. I want to be a cop because we can like only secure things. I like doing that. What I want to be in the future, I'm not so sure yet. I'm trying out many different things like business, game making, film production, and writing. Talking about dream, I actually want to be an actress. Why? I, I don't know. I just love to, to express myself and yeah, I want to be an actress, actually. Or maybe some other professions in art. Art, not that art, but art, arts. Being what I want, what I want to be in the future is really, like a really hard decision. There's so much jobs and there's so much things you can be. So I don't know which one to choose. Multiple. A lot of things. Like, there's lots. A lot. Yeah, I've done a lot of things. A lot of things like thinking about education and then business thingy and then now we're work working with the SDG to support the sustainable development goals and we're still working on it. Well, I've done many projects in the school. The first, the first month of school I made a website for weeks, the second week. Well, the second month I think I made the robot, like the life-size puppet and there's many, many more projects I did. Nasi goreng recipe, Fortnite music but yeah, in Asian culture, that is my project. Public speaking, uh, presentations. Mostly about art, probably making stuff or creating stuff. One is like making a kaleidoscope, and I made like three kaleidoscopes. I already made a song with clay and sell something with my group. Keynote and PowerPoint presentation and it's been like half or like it's been less than a year since I've been doing projects, and it's really hard. Like there's so much project that I did, I don't I can I can't remember what I did because each month there should be a project. We use plastic and I make a PowerPoint and then um, I was very nervous to present it and I make some stuff from that plastic like a pot for the plant. Uh, the pro project I have currently finished is uh, building a bridge, like an architecture. I have done a few science experiments in physics. And my current project right now is about the SDG project, about preventing poverty and to all of its forms. I'm, prob I'm probably not that important to society, but I know I'm important to my family. 
my age right now, I would probably listen to every direction what my, my parents said. But when I grow up, I probably want to make a program or something to reduce the amount of natural disasters. And maybe for the rubbish program, we can, uh, for example, recycle and to reuse, uh, to reduce the use of plastic bottles, so that we can create much more things with the use that we already been not using yet. About the trash, we use the gloves, pick them up, and try to recycle them. Get a better recycling Indonesia. Just recycle. I want to do things like taking care of the environment because many people is like being criminals over here and trying to kidnap kids and other stuff. I can't breathe, man, because uh, you know the pollution and a lot of trash and lots of cars produce gas, bad gas. And I want to reduce cars, use electric cars instead of cars with gas, saline. And I want to make a wind power plant or a water turbine, a big one, to produce clean energy. Well, I think at the moment what I can do is only spread awareness, but I have to spread awareness differently than the countless others which only talks about global warming. This. SDG project of mine I'm working on will be more about sociology and psychology of the humans, of humanity.